All right, guys, before I forget, this is what you missed on episode four. Giant deuce trying to be a three-point. All right, all right, a little three-point lefty. It blended in, I thought it was a stick. Yeah, three antlers for that day. Two brownies right off the bat, I love it. All right, if you haven't caught up, go catch up with one, two, three, four. Enjoy episode five. All right, good morning, guys. It is uh, episode five. We're gonna try this all over again. And what I mean by that, this is basically round two. I uh, was out here a little while ago, about a week ago, walked a little over six miles and had nothing to show for it. So it's hard to make a shed hunting video when you don't have sheds. <laughs> so back out here, Shed Mountain, and uh, we're gonna give it heck. I'll go ahead and show that little clip. I do have a little clip of last week's walk. And that's what it was, a big nature walk. But that's all right, back up on the mountain. And uh, hopefully my luck's a little, little bit different this time. Let's go find out. Hey guys, how you doing today? This was supposed to be episode five of Shed Tour 2024, but uh, I don't have any sheds to show for it. All Trail says I've done a little over six miles today for a big goose egg. So right now, I'm just heading back to the truck. Um, obviously, Shed Mountain kicked my butt one today. Gave me a big goose egg as far as I know, unless I find something between here and the truck. But I'm going to wrap this video up. I'll probably tie it in next time with a real episode five where there's real sheds to be found this time. So... I'm out here trying, but every now and then, every now and then, I get skunked also. So, all right, let's see, uh, see you next time. Hopefully I find some sheds. Bye for now. Hey guys, I thought I'd just give you a quick little update. Um, episode five is kicking my butt uh, when it comes to the sheds. Uh, I'm getting plenty of footage of some deer, does, yearlings, a couple bucks with a little velvet button starting to come up. But yeah, it's uh, it's kicking my butt. Uh, with the six miles last episode that I didn't really record or <clears throat> put down because there was no sheds to be found. So far, I'm not finding any sheds on this trip on episode five. Again, part whatever, do it again. So, anyways, just quick update. I'm headed back to my truck. I'm gonna have a little lunch and I'm gonna move out of this area. 
um, I'm kind of in where I was with episode three with uh, when we found the side-by-side -side set of chocolate browns and then Big Hank a year off of him. So I've been circling this buck brush and it's just kicking my butt today. I can't, no luck. I'm not on the right line today. So I'm gonna definitely gonna move on down the mountain a little bit and hopefully change, change my luck up. So hopefully I'll have an antler to show you next time I see you. All right, guys, uh, I'm relocated and I got some good news to tell you. I finally broke the curse of episode five of no sheds. My previous trip, I did four and a half miles uh, just a little while ago. I've made another, I've been out here a whole another time, and I, which I didn't make another episode, but I did six miles that day. So five, ten and a half miles to come across this bad boy. Let me turn the camera around. And here he is, the 10 mile shed. Looks to be like a hard white. Boy, I worked my butt off for him. Let's pick him up. Oh, he might be a, a chalky. He's a hard chalky. Boy, I worked hard for him. never worked so hard for a hard white slash chalk in my life. Ten and a half miles. Let's go pick up a few more. Finally feels good to have an antler on episode five, let me tell you. Alright guys, so I've been glassing this hillside, letting my binoculars do a little work for me. And about 100 yards back, I found a, what I thought was an antler, so I came this way. Just confirmed it's definitely an antler. Check him out. Oh, yeah. Boy, looks like a little three point, maybe a brown that's been sitting here, kind of starting to bleach out, but yeah, looks like a brown. All right. Nice. A little baby, baby four point. All right, that feels good too to have him on the board. Whew. Like I said, this episode five has been hard. It's been rough. But now, with a little white and a, my first little brown of the day, whew, I can make a video. I can make an episode. Whew. All right, well, I'll circle around and look for him. He's got a white little funky old base on him or a button. Yes, 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 yes. All right, all you diehard shed hunters. Hope you enjoyed episode five. I know, I had fun walking around the woods making it. 12 total miles for two sheds, so it's a rough day. Rough episode, I had to uh, definitely grind it to find those two sheds. So, but I'm happy I did, I found a brown today, so I always enjoy finding brownies. All right, well, Keep it short and sweet. Take care. Have a good one. I'll see you next time on Shed Mountain.